Welcome to Daily Decipher, your reliable source for understanding the complexities of the world around us. In today's video, we're diving into a topic that has become a significant part of our lives, the remote work revolution. Imagine waking up, making your coffee, and instead of rushing to catch a bus or a train, you switch on your laptop to start your day. Sounds familiar? That's remote work for you. No commuting, no formal attire, just you in your comfortable space getting things done. In the past year, the world has seen a seismic shift in the way we work. Our homes have become our offices and our colleagues, well, they're now just pixels on a screen. But what does this mean for us? How is it reshaping our work culture, our productivity and our lives? Understanding the remote work revolution is not just about acknowledging the present, it's about preparing for the future. It's about comprehending how this shift is redefining professional boundaries, breaking geographical barriers, and challenging the conventional nine to five work culture. So buckle up as we delve into the intricacies of this revolution. From its impact on global work trends to its implications on our mental health, we'll unravel it all. Let's dive in and decipher the remote work revolution. Did you ever imagine that your living room could be your office? A place once reserved for leisurely activities, family time and relaxation has now transformed into a place of productivity and work. The sight of your comfy couch and the TV might make you think of binge watching your favourite shows, but the reality now is that the same couch and TV may also serve as your workspace and conference room. Interestingly enough, a mere glance at your coffee table, once a place for aesthetic home magazines and coasters, now reveals a workstation complete laptop a notebook, perhaps a few pens, and most importantly, a steaming cup of coffee. A space once set aside for entertaining guests has now morphed into an office environment, blurring the lines between work and home. With the advent of the COVID-19 pandemic, our home environments went from being exclusively personal spaces to embodying a professional persona as well. This unforeseen transformation was a result of the need to maintain social and limit the spread of the virus which necessitated the shift towards teleworking or remote work. Or that your colleagues would be pixels on a screen. Yes, the people you once laughed with during lunch breaks or brainstormed with during in-person meetings are now but pixels on your screen. The physical presence of colleagues, the water cooler chats, the shared smiles as you passed each other in the hallway have all been replaced with virtual meetings, shared screens and digital interactions. The pandemic has shifted the work paradigm and the term workplace has now taken on a novel meaning. The transition hasn't been easy for everyone, bringing with it new challenges such as the to maintain work-life balance, the lack of physical interaction, and the need for self-discipline. Yet it has also opened doors for greater flexibility, increased accessibility, and the possibility of a better work-life balance. This era of remote work is not merely a temporary phase, but a revolution in the way work is conducted. It has not only changed the present, but is also continuously shaping the future, redefining how and where work can be performed. It has transformed the definition of a workplace, breaking down geographical barriers and challenging the traditional nine to five work culture. The COVID-19 pandemic propelled us into the future of work sooner than we thought. And today we're delving into the interesting facts surrounding the remote work revolution. Fact one, the pandemic served as a catalyst for a global shift to remote work. In an interconnected world, where brick and mortar offices once dominated, a sudden change occurred that has developed into a new norm. A silent killer, a virus, emerged, drastically transforming our work culture and pushing a good chunk of the global workforce into their homes. This change was not just confined to the tech giants in Silicon Valley or the finance behemoths in Wall Street, it was indeed a universal shift. From bustling cities like New Delhi, Mumbai, Tokyo, London and New York to smaller towns and villages, everyone felt the tremors of this massive shift. Companies, both big and small, in sectors as diverse as IT, media, finance, education and healthcare, were forced to re-evaluate their operational norms. Traditional workspaces were abandoned overnight and an era of digital communication and remote collaboration began. We saw a steep rise in the use of technology platforms that facilitate remote work. Video conferencing and project management tools became the new essential utilities. Furthermore, the shift wasn't just about the workspace, it was about the work culture as well. 
Employees were now presented with an opportunity to blend their work and personal lives, bringing about a new work-life balance. Though this shift came with challenges of its own, such as the need for self-discipline, the inability to disconnect from work, and the lack of social interaction, it also presented opportunities for introspection and personal growth. In India, a country known for its IT prowess, the shift was felt more profoundly. In a nation where daily commutes to work often meant hours stuck in traffic, work from home brought about a refreshing change. The time saved from commuting could now be used for personal development or family time, thereby improving overall work satisfaction and balance. However, this new reality also brought with it a set of challenges. The lack of a physical boundary between work and home, inadequate infrastructure and connectivity issues, and the struggle to maintain productivity and motivation were some of the concerns that individuals and companies had to grapple with. Despite these challenges, the resilience of individuals and organizations shone through. Companies quickly adopted new tools and techniques to manage remote teams efficiently. It was a quick transition, yet it was managed efficiently. But it was not just about survival. It was about adapting and growing in an era of unprecedented change. In light of lockdowns and social distancing mandates, companies in India and elsewhere had no choice but to adapt quickly and efficiently. Fact two, tech hubs, notably Bengaluru and Hyderabad, became epicenters for remote work. Situated in the heart of India, these cities have been the cradle of the country's technological boom for the last couple of decades. Their meteoric rise is a story of economic transformation, cloaked in the vibrant colors of the numerous cultures that thrive here. The skyscrapers that punctuate the city's skyline are a testament to their economic prowess, housing countless startup companies and established IT giants. Each building, a fortress of innovation and cutting-edge technology, buzzes with the electricity of thousands of ideas being brought to life. The humming servers and countless lines of code are the lifeblood of these tech hubs. But beyond the physical infrastructure, the soul of these cities lies in their people. A diverse mix of engineers, project managers, designers, coders, all united by a common thread, a relentless pursuit of technological innovation. Ideas are exchanged, plans are drafted, and solutions are coded into existence with the blink of an eye. The energy is palpable, creating an electric atmosphere of progress and discovery. At the heart of it all, the IT companies sit like chess masters, orchestrating and strategizing. They have seamlessly transitioned into the new era of remote work, showing a remarkable level of adaptability. With the advent of the pandemic, these companies were quick to switch gears, proving their agility even in the face of adversity. The shift to remote work was not just about the physical aspect of working from home, it was about fostering a culture of flexibility, resilience and innovation. The ability to alter work models, to continue providing indispensable services, all while ensuring the safety and well-being of their employees was truly commendable. The transition was a mammoth task with numerous hurdles, but these companies handled it with a dexterity that was inspiring. They leveraged technology to its fullest potential, developing new tools and platforms to facilitate seamless remote operations. IT companies, in particular, pivoted with an agility that underscored the inherent adaptability of the tech industry. They stand as a beacon of resilience and innovation, and their story continues to inspire millions worldwide. Fact 3. The sudden shift to remote work brought the issue of work-life balance into sharp focus. With the boundaries between work and personal life blurred, the conversation around maintaining a healthy balance became more important than ever. Fact 4. Co-working spaces emerged as a popular solution for those seeking a professional environment outside of their homes. This trend reflected the growing demand for flexible work arrangements. Fact 5. The digital divide, however, proved to be a significant hurdle. Disparities in access to technology hampered remote work capabilities in India and other countries, highlighting the need for digital inclusivity. Fact 6. The mental health implications of remote work became a topic of global concern. The isolation and blurred work-life boundaries impacted the mental well-being of employees across the world. Fact 7. On the brighter side, remote work led to a noticeable increase in productivity. The flexibility to work from anywhere proved to be a boon for employees in India and around the globe. Fact 8. The talent pool expanded beyond geographical boundaries as companies began hiring remotely. This shift towards a more inclusive hiring process was a positive outcome of the remote work revolution. Fact 9. 
hybrid work models combining in-office and remote work gained traction. This approach offered the best of both worlds, providing flexibility while retaining some semblance of traditional work culture. Fact 10. The changes brought about by the remote work revolution are likely to persist. Companies are now focusing more on flexibility, digital tools, and employee well-being. In conclusion, the remote work revolution, triggered by the pandemic, has brought about significant changes in our work cultures. It has presented us with challenges and opportunities, prompting us to rethink traditional work models and adapt to new ones. Before we wrap up, let's quickly recap the key points we discussed today. We delved into the global shift to remote work, highlighting how tech hubs have become epicenters for this revolution. We examined the growing importance of work-life balance and the rise of co-working spaces in this new dynamic. We also touched on the digital divide and its implications and the mental health considerations that have come to the fore. We discussed how remote work has led to an increase in productivity and the expansion of the talent pool and looked at how hybrid work models are becoming the new norm. As we have seen, these changes are not temporary, they are here to stay, reshaping our work cultures and lifestyles. It is important for us to understand these shifts and adapt accordingly. Remember, the future of work is here and it's remote. The remote work revolution is not just about working from home, it's about working from anywhere, anytime, in a way that suits you best. It's about flexibility, autonomy and finding a balance between work and life. So, let's embrace this change, understand its implications and make the most of the opportunities it presents. After all, we are not just surviving in this new world of work, we are thriving in it. Remember, if you found this video insightful, give it a thumbs up, share it with your network and subscribe for more enlightening content. Thanks for tuning in to Daily Decipher. Stay connected, stay productive and see you in the next video. We hope you found this video insightful. It's your turn now. If you have any thoughts, insights or experiences about the remote work revolution, we'd love to hear them. Don't hesitate to light up the comment section below with your views. Your interaction not only helps us understand your perspective better, but it also enriches the whole community with diverse viewpoints. So like, share, subscribe and most importantly comment. Remember, your engagement helps us create more content like this. We appreciate your support and look forward to hearing from you. Thank you for your continued support of Daily Decipher.